Hi guys, this is Saloni and welcome back to our channel Codera. So this is the first video of our MySQL tutorial series. So without any delay, let's start the discussion. So guys, in this video, we will talk about what is data, what is database and what are the types of database. So guys, if you will look closely to the word database, then it contains two words, which are data and the base. So the word data is originated from the word datum which means a single piece of information. So the collection of raw, unorganized, unprocessed facts or details is called data. So the text, any type of media, figures, symbols, etc. are the data. And guys, data itself has no importance because with the help of raw data only, we can't make any decision. So raw data is of no use, but we can translate that data into an efficient form so that we can use that data for processing. So here are some examples of the data like test score of students, temperature readings, match score, name or age. All these are the data. So for example, let's say test score of a student. So this test score is of no use until we make any decision out of them like the average of scores or the student is passed or fail and so on. So now I hope you guys understand what is the data. Now let's move towards our next topic which is what is database. So database is a collection of data stored in some organized fashion so that we can easily access and manage it. So as we already discussed about the data. So in a database we store that data in an organized manner so that we can access that data easily. So you can think a database as a container which stores our data in an organized fashion. But guys, there is a confusion among the students about the database. So guys, we often use the term database to refer to the database softwares we are using. For example, MySQL, Oracle, MongoDB and so on. We refer these softwares as the database. But actually, these are the database management systems or DBMS. And using this DBMS, we create the container called the database so that we can store our data in those containers. So now let's understand the term database with some real life examples. So the best analogy of database is school registry. So here in school registry, all the details of the students are registered. So from this registry, you can access the detail of any student. And guys, we are aware of it or not, but we are using the database all the time. Each time you select a contact on your phone or a name from your email address book, you are using a database. If you conduct a Google search, then you are using a database. Nowadays, we are all using Facebook and Instagram. So these apps are also using database to store the data about the users, their friends, messages and so on and also the online shopping applications like Amazon, Flipkart, Mintra, they also need database to store the data related to the customer, products, order, payments and so on. So guys, database is present everywhere and there are many types of database management systems available. So according to the requirement, we can use the different database management systems. So here are some different type of databases. Like the first one is relational database. So this is the one of the most common type of database we use. So you can create this database using the following database management systems which are Oracle, MySQL, Microsoft SQL Server and so on. And if you are preparing for any interview, so this is the mostly asked type of database, especially for the freshers. And also in written test, they ask queries based on relational databases. And in this complete video series, we will also use a relational database which is MySQL. And here are some other databases like NoSQL database, Cloud database, Document database, White Column database, Object Oriented database and many more. So you can pause the screen to note down the databases. So guys, this is all about the data, database and its types. I hope you guys understand these topics. So in the next video, we will discuss some important terminology related to the database. And still, if you have any doubt, then please drop a comment in the comment box. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe our channel.